their first match. However, he will be on the sidelines for this one as warm-ups now get set. And for Los Angeles, the men's duel, Francisco Leal, Javi Leal, they call him, and Tolito Aguirre. 26-year-old and 20-year-old, so a young duo on the side of Los Angeles. There's a look at Tolito as he gets set. A chance to see wildly dynamic and creative play from Tolito. Or his partner, just 20 years old. This sport continues to grow in its youth ranks. Adi Liao, one of the great examples currently sitting at that number 36 spot in terms of a world ranking. Currently one of the youngest players on tour. Pito, the Argentinian. And for Orlando, Mijo we saw earlier, product of Spain. Lima of Brazil. There's the four faces you can get to know in this matchup for the PPL. Fifth match of the day, $150,000 on the line in this first event. The first of four leading up to the PPL Cup Fun. Our first two, just in two weeks' time, the first day starts our Red Robin competition. We've seen extended play, wonderful tiebreakers just about every single matchup. Some big time upsets on the day. The Matrix, although they just took a loss, did pick up a win over the Cancun Waves. And then it was a second, we'll call it an upset, in the second match of the day as the San Diego Stingrays took down the Florida Goats. And then it was fun. We got a chance to see the number one player in the world, Agustin Tapia for the Miami Paddle Club in our third match of the day versus the Toronto Polar Bears. That men's Brilliant. matchup was one of the best that you will see pushed to the absolute limit. Koki Nieto, also a part of the Toronto Polar Bears roster who was just so fun to watch from a defensive standpoint. Give it a second, go back and watch that men's matchup. It's one of our best matches of the day. This may be just as well. Look to Pablo Lima, the lefty. He'll be playing the drive position on the right side. Two righties on the opposition. This Los Angeles beat team rounds out a very solid roster. We have the number one player from the United States, a part of this roster as well, Luis Estrada mention a couple other big names, Agustin Salingo, as well as Alec Ruiz, Captain America they call him. However, you will not see those three on the court this given juncture. All eyes will be set on Toledo. Good afternoon, welcome to DPL. The following map Deja, right now. Nice and warmed up. Maps of conversation between Florida Goats for the women for and Los, Los Angeles. Angeles. Jordana Lujan also Player. on this team. And Ellie. Left with her from Florida. Hello, Lima. Pablo Nico. That's one of the fun parts of this PPL right format. Roster Angeles. increased from 10 Leona, to 12 Leona. this past season. Get a chance to see more players than ever before, and especially coming from the, the international will ranks. With Golden Point System, we'll play two sets with Tyrek. And in case of Over growth, the 80% play of the new signees of the in 2024 point. coming from the top 50 in the world. Of those 12 players you can have on each given roster, you have a chance to have eight internationals. And we've seen about 14 of those coming from Spain. The rest from just about every corner of the world, including a handful from the United States. The level has no doubt increased in North America. Right now, getting a few coaching cues before heading out. One of the great elements to this PPL format is the chance to see 
all the minds come together in unison to create a game plan and face off against one another. So many inputs, you got to sort through the weeds to figure out exactly how you want to approach every given opponent, especially one that just changed from what you might have seen earlier in the day, like this team from Orlando. You prep for one, and all of a sudden you got a different opponent in front of you. Not to mention how they come together. You might have those individual scouting reports, but this is going to be a different beast for Los Angeles. Pablo Lijo getting those last and final adjustments. Bench is full on the Los Angeles side. Javi Leal getting this ready to go. Taking the edge off the ball. VIP section starting to fill in. Everyone's eyes now set to championship court. The women out on the grandstand. We'll be sure to catch you up in terms of their progression through this match. If you're just joining us for the first time, you must win two of the three possible matches in this head-to-head -head team matchup. If you split one and one, you head to a mixed doubles format for that third and final. Just one set being played. Seen a handful of competitions go that direction today. You'll still end up playing that mixed matchup as well in this round robin format. Try and figure out some of those point differentials. And the potential ties we may see after the four days of round robin. But now we are set for the fifth match of the day. Let's get started. The Los Angeles beat and the Florida goats. Toledo with the serve. Sending this all the way to the back glass. Some communication issues. This time it's Lima. Toledo checking down, chasing that lob, and it's gorgeous coming off the back glass. Look at that smile. He knows that was a pretty shot to start with. Back to back now Sorry, for the beat. Lito again, added pressure and power. Leal tries to find one, but it's 4-4 for Lijo. 315. Watch how quick Lijo can get all the way up to the net. Anticipation on point. And the backhand flip. Out of bounds, 30 all. Beautiful drop. A gorgeous touch from Los Angeles. Chance to hold. Legal return down the line and into the net. So LA, the game first to strike a hold game. as first they game. earn game number one for the Los Angeles beat. 
Just their first match of the, of the day, playing in some fun and unique conditions. Things have no doubt cooled off as we have hit about the 7.30 mark in the evening. Here's a look back at the replay. Some of the great cuts from Tolito. That was game point for the beep. Get a chance now to play beneath the sunset and underneath the lights. The Rulu from the lefty. Rulo using that inside out spin, finding the fence. Great step on the volley, a little extra emphasis. Just playing inches above the height of the net. Trying to maintain their court position. Leho finds himself at the base of the court. But it's the goats that walk away with the point. Nice chase from Lima. Beautiful backhand down the line. Again, watch the eyes as these athletes continue to track the lobs going back over the top of their head. They oftentimes drop their eyes and their vision to the opposite side to see where their opponents are located in terms of court position. Gives them a better glim glimpse as to where they might locate that next shot. Wild amounts of communication. And plenty of power. Lima just pushing that ball. Lima heavily involved in the early stages of this set. Off the back and side glass for Lijo. Covered yet again, both to the glass now. Working with opposing lobs. Using that band they had to give them plenty of time to get back, but ultimately it's Tolito patrolling the length of the net. 40 30. Watch Tolito come across, great recognition. Chopping that into the corner. Forty thirty. Use golden point. Javier Real. First Turzi. golden point of this matchup. Next point wins. An early chance for LA to break. Red, but it goes too far to the opposite side. Golden point awarded Florida. to the Florida Goats. Florida leads. Tied now one apiece. First set. Lijo off the high lob. That's fine, Tolito. Heavy swing, and it's Leal. Just too much power. Amazing location. 
nearly a missed contact. Unreal going off the side glass, but it's still picked up by Lima. Slowing it down, trying to find their way back at the net, but it's too big of a smash. The LA beat now up 30 love. 30 love. How do you come back after an extended point like that? Florida Goats need to find their footing. Not following in that lob. The lob and volley, except for that's out of bounds. Off to Lito's racket. Sorry, team. One of the unique patterns you'll find in this sport. The lob and follow in for a volley. Too much pace, but Liho's all over it. Gets just enough of a racket on it. Airborne with Liao, but Liho finds yet another response. Not it up. 30 all. Man, this is a fun one to get started. Unforced error on the side of the beat. 30-40. Toledo can't believe it. Break point. Goats. Law, but cut off. Lima. Just a light touch. Oh, and off the fence, didn't give the bounce. Just such you a tough ball for Lijo. Our second golden point now. To receive. Waited patiently Palina for it. To receive. A question in terms of where that serve and return bounced, but ultimately ball out of bounds, and the Los Angeles beat walk away with their second game so far. It's been a hold along the entirety of this first set. I'll step aside. You get a chance to listen in to the benches and our coaches' notes. To this point, it's been a series of holds on each side of the net, but already showcased an outstanding performance from all four of these athletes. Been fun to watch. Lima seems to be doing a bit more of the work here as he's now partnered alongside Lee Ho, who's been 
really solid in terms of a defensive standpoint so far in the early stages of this matchup. If there's a player cam that I want to see every single time that I can, it's this guy. Tolito Aguirre, the magic man. His nickname is The Alien. And if you look at his racket, he has an alien in his racket. I love it. That's the reason why. Look at that. There you see it. The Alien. You're just joining One us. of I'm the most magical over. players, no doubts. He's always doing some trick shots and cool stuff. Fun to watch, Torito. I'm ready to serve. If you're just joining us, I'm Cameron Irwin alongside Gonzalo Opina. You're just right joining there. me after taking just a short break. We've, yes. been <laughs> we've had a long day Much ourselves. Needed. Sending that to back glass. A great save, but that ball is out of the stadium. For Cuatro, for Lima. That was beautiful. This was a good save from Tolito, but then Lima stepping in. 15 love. A fantastic serve, the backhand side. Almost getting handcuffed against the glass. Make it 30 love. Side spin from Liho. That overhead. Ducking out of the way, it's Leal. But still, the ball returns. Point For you. to the Goats. Leal is, his nickname is Lethal. Leal Lethal. <laughs> and that's because he has a big smash. Sometimes maybe he's not doing the right decisions. You have to know when to hit it. Yeah, that's the second time we've actually seen him go for a smash and have it returned up at the net from a counter attack from Leo. 4015 now. It's another hold for the Goats. Two games apiece. Now turn for Tolito to serve. Oh, and a touch off the top of the net and Lucky. off the racket of Leal. That was unlucky for Javi Leal. Sunset starting the match. The jerseys of the Los Angeles beat. Again, great aggressive steps from Tolito up at the net. Oh, the defense is just not enough from Lijo. The volleys from Tolito Aguirre are so strong. He uses so much spin. What a player. 15 all now. Wait, let, let for serve. Gonna replay the point. Ball on the exterior of the court. Just a moment of distraction. Still the first serve. Change Thanks, of pace. Man. Tough ball. Well managed and back to the net for the beat. Liho is everywhere. Covering the opposite side is Lima. There's some top spin, and it is a deadly strike from Lima. Two hand backhand, cross court, surprising there. Tolito Aguirre catching him off guard. Tolito Still. Aguirre Cam is actually playing another tour, the A1 Paddle Tour, as well as Gonz Alfonso, his teammate. Is going to be playing the next match. Good communication wow. and falling for the save is Lima. Can Tolito get there? Oh, just snuck away from him. 1540. We're gonna have three break points. Watch the effort here from Tolito. And then Lima 
beautiful por tres. Goats looking for their first break. Wow, what a volley now from Leal is going for a power smash, but Lico gets it, doesn't send it out, but wins the point. What a recovery from Pablo Lico to win and to break the serve. They take the advantage, three to two. The first break of set number one, the direction of the Goats. That is the third time we have now seen Lijo able to recover off of a smash from Liao and score a point. Just like that, nearly identical plays in this first set. The first break now found in this first set between the Los Angeles Beach and the Florida Goats. Fantastic performance from the Goats in that last game. Able to sneak a couple more away, but I imagine they'll continue to look potentially the direction of Lial if they keep winning points off of his smash. Continuing the direction of Leal, every ball now going his way. Tolito getting his first look. Bandeja and the attack now. Maybe the smash was oh, not coming key. high enough. But Lima was back there near the baseline, so the decision was good. Maybe the execution was not perfect, but since the decision was a good one, they won the point. Patient approach, and it is deadly. The Bahada off the glass. Down the middle. No one was home. Look at that. Boom. What spin on that ball. Quick pick up. Thought about going. Did Tolito. Said, gave himself more time. That was a weird bounce. And how about one more? Recovered his own. And yet another opportunity off a Leal smash. Polito with class. Lima almost using the glass as a trampoline, but the extended play to LA. That was a beautiful Isn't smash there. from Tolito Aguirre, now por tres. But so far, the match Pablo Lijo is playing, it's absolutely brilliant. Goats. How Good about block. that block at the back of the court? The right decision, letting that ball fall. Out of bounds and good communication. 30 all. Fox 
They'll break off the goats. You have to see Tolito's kid, <laughs> his son. He's, I don't know, three, four years old. Oh. But he, the, the racket is Four bigger turns. than him, but still, <laughs> he plays, like, amazingly. It's incredible to see it. Coming back to the action, 40-34, the GOATs. Calling that serve out. Served right up the middle, Second actually, serve. and there's going to be some conversation here. Second serve. It's looking to extend their lead. Perfect. And finds the foot of Lima. Ouch. Good move from Toledo from the baseline to the net, pushing a lot. This is our third golden point here in set number one. And it's going to be a chance for the beat. To come back to the game, to retake the serve. Yeah. And the goats survive. Still on four games to do. They save the break point. Good move there by Pablo Lico with a backhand to the corner, cross court, hurting Javi Leal. So far, he's winning that duel. That backhand duel between Lijo and Javi Leal. I can't get over just how different the style of play is from one match to another, and especially just with the partner switch between Lijo and Lima. Team Pablo over there. like Lijo is picking the right Love times and making the right choices. Yes, and he's running to the net whenever he has to. Doing some incredible recoveries. This guy, Pablo Lijo. We were talking about it in the previous match. Cam, he is a talented player, but sometimes the mentality just goes away. If he's in the right path, he could be this player. Well, I think Speaking of someone in the right path, that was a, a big, big, smash. big smash from Leal. Maybe that can make a difference in terms of him picking up more winning shots versus them being able to be recovered. Lee Ho cocks back the elbow and wow. comes away with a fantastic location for Tres. That was a big hit once again for Tres. Down the line, the hardest shot in paddle. And the bit once again suffering a lot. Looks like we have some news, some updates from the other court cam. It is 15 love Arkansas with the serve also up five to three. This is a look back to our previous match. So two different teams currently out on the court than what you're seeing on championship court. They're closing out this mixed doubles competition. You can see Nico Agretelli for the Atlantics. And so the far, Matrix Salo, on Salo, the other side. Salo Rubio and the Patti are a strong team. So far, they can win two out of two matches in the mixed doubles. There, the mistake from Virginia Riera. It's 40 love match point. To knock down Campagnolo and Virginia Riera. Salo goes for the serve. Yaguno in the effort. She lets it go and it's game set and match for the Arkansas Matrix. Beating in this mixed match. Campagnolo and Riera beating New York Atlantics. And again, the, the importance of that matchup is the fact that you're still adding sets one in terms of your team total through this round robin format on day number one. Again, the New York Atlantics had already picked up the victory in terms of a two now to one score over the Arkansas Matrix. 
As we now head back to championship court, another game having been added to the scoreboard. Here's a look at Pablo Lima. Fun to see just how many different skill sets he's able to utilize in this second match of the day for him. That lefty, as we take a bit of a second here side of the court. Pablo Lima to serve. Now playing underneath the lights here on Championship Court. The sun has set. Yes, finally for us. That's good news, Cam. And another good ball. 50 long. Five to two out of the change event. Florida found their second break. Dominating. Flies just too much from Pablo Lima. 15 all. The beat had a break point in the previous game. Not able to convert. Real finds himself way up at the net as he chases that. Can't get his racket on it. And another por tres down the line from Pablo Lijo. Absolutely brilliant. Yeah, he has no doubt stepped up his game. Thirty fifteen. And another yeah. one. big hit from Pablo Lijo sending the ball out of the court. 40-15, they will have three set points. The GOATs to take the lead. And Game all they needed was one. Set number one Five, belongs six, to the to Florida two. GOATs, six to two. They came out roaring. It was nearly knotted uh, for the entirety. Hold, hold, hold until ultimately a break to pick up the third point for the GOATs. And then they found yet another break at the fifth. And then closing it off with a hold for their sixth point. A massive heads up play from these two. Team Pablo picking up set number one. Second set, Leonel Aguirre to serve. Second set underway. And nearly losing his racket out of his hand is Lima. Time for a different response from Los Angeles. Seems as if the score was rather lopsided. However, there were several golden points in that first set alone. 
I believe three, if not four, of those games going to a golden point. Completely different scenario now for the GOATs compared to the first matchup of the day. Now the beat have to find something different, something else. Probably also Leal try to make better decisions when it comes to smashing. That's the second time he's done what we'll call a half jump, putting his feet back on the ground Fair and enough. finding his next contact. Tolito, another unique way to approach the sport. It is unique. <laughs> it's so fun to watch. Putting up the hand, recognizing the moment, taking an extra time. Liao tries to find this, but Liho, again, has just been somewhat unstoppable Third here in this first now into the second set. He seems to be carrying over his game from one to the other. He's using the Portres a lot in this match, Pablo Liho. A lot. And winning all of the points. Why do you think he started with that? Because he's been going for the portrait through the entirety. Probably is one of the best shots he has, okay. so he uses it a lot. Today feeling good and using his biggest weapon. <laughs> the goats fight one off, 40, maybe 30. a few more here. Down 30 40. Perfect read. He was waiting for him in the net. Pablo Rico. There he was. A second before reading the perfect play. Wow. Yeah. A massive smash. In Los Angeles. First game. For Florida. Second set. Ball change. Picking up game number one. They find a hold to start off set number two. That was Seba Neron, eh? He is the main coach of this LA beat. He was talking now to Javi Leal, trying to, to find something different for their guys. So far, so good for Pablo Lijo and for Pablo Lima. They have to win the match. The team lost in the first match of the day. One of the two teams playing a couple of them during the first day of competition. The LA beat is the first matchup of this Pro Paddle League 2024. Well, you'll have a chance to see all 10 teams on this first day. It's time to pick some of your favorites. If you like a player, you like a team, or if you simply just like their team, you might as well get behind the bandwagon else. team. If you like a Southpaw, like Lima, why not become a fan of the Florida Goats? Trying to off. wish that ball over the net. A high and an extra high lob at that. Off the fence. Wow. Incredible. Super bajada de pared there. Perfect placement and pace from Pablo Lijo. Finding the corner. I'm impressed with the very decisive play through the middle of the court from the GOATs. Pablo Lijo is playing well today in this match. Yes. A couple touches in the net from Gabi Leal. That was super lucky. Well, it's even more impressive to me because you have two forehands through the middle. So you would imagine both of them wanting to be the aggressors here, but both of them choosing the right times to step in. Really impressive. The Chiquita off the glass. It's just not in. It's just not in. The team needs him. 40-15 now for the GOATs. work now it seems like more towards Lima. Lijo hasn't touched it. They stayed down the line and tried to. It looks like a different approach for the Los Angeles beat, but nonetheless. In Florida, one is all another game for the goats. One to one, another hold. Time for Javier to serve. 
Again, they need something different. Especially Javi Leal not making that many on force errors. What a big hit there for Torito Aguirre, bringing the ball back to his court. Shout, screaming. There, she, there he goes. And the ball comes back. Torito. Javi Leal with a lot of power. From Tolito, he was close to the net, waiting Four for a fake for tres. Forty love. He almost got this one in the teeth. More like the six pack. It's a hold for LA beat. Two games to one. one in the second set. Short break and we'll be back with more Pro Paddle League 2024. <laughs> Pablo Lima to serve. Back to the action now. 2 1. Los Angeles speed on top. Fifty long. Lima. Look in the direction of Leal. Great return. It's the goal it's at the defensive. Ouch. Owie. That That's going to hurt. And Lima seems unfazed. Of course, Javier you know. says sorry. Oh. oh. Right in the noggin. <laughs> that hurts. This is the one time it's good to be hard-headed. Flattens that out, off the backhand side, and another good lead. Seems like some more energy on the side of LA. Good move there by Javi Leal, turning around and going to the corner. Well, 1540. 15-40, three break points for the Beats. Mm -hmm. 
High ball. Low this time. Two different lobs. And then flattens it out. A series wow. of shots. Tolito is back on the ground and back on his feet. Back to neutral we go. High over Lima. Tolito finding his footing with an outrageous block as he runs to the net. Out of the court and out of the hand of Liao. Finishing the point with class. But Tolito with a couple of good born. saves. And then another por tres. Look at that one. Diving for the ball, then blocking another one. This one, and then the finish by Pablo Lijo with this por tres. Creating a lot of angle, pushing the ball super wide. Use golden point. Saving the first. Now they save the second one, Cam, and they have a golden yeah, point. Like to Try to break the surf. Tolito's on it. So good. Too good from Tolito. Tolito was there out of the court waiting for it. As usual, Three and it's one. always him, Second the seven. alien, going out, saving the ball. And in this crucial moment, Tolito Aguirre, the magic man. Look at that. He was there, and bang. Inside again. 3-1 for LA Beat. That was beautiful. That was amazing. Love the celebration after the fact, too. Tolito currently also wiping off maybe a bit of blood on his knee as he's still on the sideline. He did take a little bit of a diving save. I've seen a handful of those today. The clutch. A break for LA. Half volleys, increasing the tempo, or the goats. Nice block out of his pocket, that's Liho. Yeah, and out of bounds, not enough defense on the side Good of luck. the goats. This is starting to spell trouble. But look at Tolito, the confidence he has. And whenever he's playing this way, he's just unstoppable. He's going to perform. Three now. Like in any other sport, confidence is so important. But for these players, really, really a key. Great extension on that volley, keeping that nice and flat. Change of direction, but a fantastic redirect, sending that to the fence. Now it's a different story. Portilov. This is a completely different team from set one to set two for LA. It is. Hot. Drop shot. And he's all <laughs> over it. Got a little lucky there as he popped it up. 40-15. Chance to increase the lead, LA. With a handful here. 40-30. After that, Tolito was saying, está bien, está bien, it's okay. Don't worry, just a mistake. And they've got some grace, period. We here. have to go to the next point, doesn't matter. 40-30. Heads up. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think they were ducking about uh, three states away. They were just watching the match, <laughs> chill, and suddenly they almost got hit. It's four games to one for LA Beat Camp. A different story, for sure. There's that fantastic play from Tolito. That was the highlight of that last one. Meanwhile, they'll step aside and listen in to the coach. Si te viene a bolear, hijo. No. Si te viene a bolear, hijo, y estás colgado, no le vayas con la bandeja. Si le vas a tirar fuerte, tirar un vigorazo. ¿Entendés? 
si te viene a bolear, es competir con el lugar a su porque, porque la bandeja vas a perder fuerza. Sí. No es lo mismo. Si llegás lejos y te viene el hijo, si, si decidís que la volé el hijo, prendelo fuego con la víbora. ¿Entendés? ¿Estamos? Leo, no te hablas, ¿eh? Vamos acá, que vamos a ir de nuevo. Sí, vamos a ver. Vamos de nuevo. Vamos de Pablo Lico, tu ser. Four one, beat looking to push this to a tie break, a ten point tie break in the third. If they make it that direction. Play under the starlight. Very long. That's why from Pablo Lima. Thirty fifteen. Thirty fifteen now for the goats. Leal tossing his hands 15. out of a bit of frustration. Letting that ball drop just enough shoulder height from Lijo. In Florida, Los Not the second time we've seen him come away with a winner. Four games to do now. Oh, beauty. No. Saves no. again. <laughs> KG play from Leo. <laughs> that was probably the highlight of the day. Love the team. Look at that. The angle by Javi Leal. The spin allows the lead to do that, that one, and then Lico brings it back in. <laughs> Leal found, finds one. Sent back into the air and a bit of a tough one for Toledo. He was kind of backpedaling into that. Love 30. Love 30 now. <laughs> Cutting that off before it finds the sidewall. Continuing to force Leal to hit. Flat shot down from Lijo. And extra power. Lijo is back alive here in set two. They're going to have 40. four break points. Make things even again. Wow. Of course, it was a short lob shot from Tolito Aguirre, but the power he has is brilliant. Absolutely return from Lijo, half full. They save the first one. Finding Lima's foot there. Make it 15-40. He's walking away with a little damage right now from head to toe. Calculated. And 
they got it. Once again, everything is even. 4-3 for the beat, but no breaks in the second set. Pablo Lima, to serve. Coming back out of the break. Florida. Looking to find set two. Lifted and he's giving Liho the opportunity and understandably, Liho is getting hot right now. The MVP of the match so far. Playing good. Great placement down the line. Tough. Puts race once more. And Liho. That Burn way off. he sends it out of the court. Having the lock that you need. If it hits the back wall, he's going to send it out of the court. If he hits the fence, also he's going to send the ball out <laughs> of the court. Either way, it's working for Liho. How about a little vertical? And the soft touch to the Nets from Leo. He's got it all in his bag right now. It's not only Four power. Nine. First the smash and now the classy touch. Look at that. He goes to the net. He reads the play from Tolito. And he leaves the ball there just really close to the net. Utilizing the depth of the court is LA. Sending once more. That was a beautiful back and back post from Tolito. Another one. Oh, another great snag. Uh -huh. And oh. into the shoulder, LA. That's like salt in the wound. Good effort there by Javi Leal going out of the court to pick that one up. But then when he was coming back, Lijo saw him and found him there, boom. Three, three straight games now for Florida to tie the score at four all. And it's a game for the Goats, four to four. Got themselves back into this. Another Portres. This is the Portres show, Cam. Yeah, and that one actually a little bit softer, too. Tolito expected that maybe to end up more towards the direction of the net and the post, but ultimately ended up near the back glass on the outside of the court. Lock. And again, he's got the Midas touch right now, Look everything 30. going his direction. It's like when a player in basketball is just throwing 
and hitting absolutely everything. Well, same situation here for Pablo Lijo. We call that in rhythm. And right now, Lijo is no doubt in a bit of a groove. He's playing amazing now. Add one more. Tolito is quick with the feet. Right now having to fight to send this ball back. Slightly inside out with wow. the smash. And that one is out, out, and further out. Lima is loving his partner's play. Pablo Lijo, the absolute MVP of the match. Love 40 now. They will have four break points. The GOATs are just on fire. I don't think you typically want a goat on fire, but... <laughs> In this case, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh. Starting to play the direction of Lima, and there oh is a God. heavy arm. God, you could just hear the sound. Off the racket. You do that to me, I do that to you. Fabi Leal with power, oh. another Portres. Every single point finishes with a Portres in this match. <laughs> Quick exchange up at the net. Leal needing the energy. 30-40. 30-40, they still have to string a handful of points together. And again, the que bueno sauce from Tolito. How good you are, Javi. Come on. There How good go. Tolito is. Deuce. Go the point. Tough serve. Find ourselves a deuce. Pablo Lima, After three. Beat. La 40 down. Now the beat has a golden point to deal with. from the opposite side, and it still works. LA fights back and finds yet another game. And we just love the energy from this team. of a battle having picked so, up their fifth point or their fifth game excuse me the goats the second team to be playing twice at this day as well as the arkansas matrix, matrix. my goodness plenty of emotion coming from the la beat got to do what it takes Yes, you do. 15 0 on the scoreboard. See ya. And that ball is into the stands. A bit of a souvenir. 15 30. There she comes back. back. I would have took it. <laughs> Sending back a foul ball. 
We both got a free ticket to enjoy paddle from the stands. <laughs> Quick footwork from Tolito, the magician. LA needs just one more game. Send this to set three. Right decision from Lee Hall. Secondary lob now. Oh, just oh. in. As close as it gets. Lima, a massive stride to get to that last ball. He has to go to the other side now. Oh. Will Lijo get there? Yeah! No, he cannot. It's LA all day. And Cam, we will have three set points for LA beat. After losing the first one, we have now a chance to force a tiebreaker to 10 points. Big smash now from Javi Leal. Can they close the deal? Off the glass. Tough ball, backhand lob. Lima says no problem. Keeping the goats alive here in the second set. 34. It was a tough shot. He had to execute a bajada with the backhand, which is super tough. Both LAE beat players were in the net, but somehow they survived. Two, breaks po two break points still to deal with for the goats. One more. Golden point. We are now to a golden Adriana. point. Still a set point for the beat. Can you feel the beat? <laughs> <laughs> for some now reason that will that be that stuck that. in my head. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> oh. Hey, goats, can you feel the beat or not? That ball stays good. Dropping down to a knee is Leal. And the beat come away with the golden point and the set. 6-4. Time to head to a third set tie break. That was a super recovery from LA Beat. They were a breakdown in the second set and somehow they survived. Tolito Aguirre was definitely pushing the team a lot. Especially from the mental side of the play and now we will have a super emotional tie break here to decide who will take the win in this match. Así es la sencilla, porque sos el más potente de la cancha y el que más recursos tiene cuando la trata que queda para pegarle. Entonces, vos tenés que llegar a ese momento, pero no haciendo biribiri. Ah, sí, 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 no haciendo biribiri en todos lados. Vale. Ah, es sencillo. Y acá, cuando vienen de este lado, sean valientes con el globo, peguen bien. ¿Te cuenta la piedra, la, la lima, eh, la piedra, lo que la lijó? ¡Pum! Se, se, se te frena. Entonces, ¿no podemos hacer lo mismo? Sí, claro que sí. Vamos. Bien, bien caminado, muy bien caminado. Javi, un montón, un montón. Muy bien. Vamos, vamos, vamos. 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 I feel as if we have gone to so many tie breaks throughout the entirety of day number one. Are you surprised that this is how far we've come on I the day? I am not. I am not for sure. We have a lot of talents, a lot of good players. And when you bring these assets to a paddle court, 
it's going to usually be super tight, super close, so I'm not surprised that we have a lot of tie breaks today. And in my opinion, Camp, we will have a lot more for the next days. We're gonna have new balls for the super tie break. Again, if this is your first match, you have to know that it's up to 10 points and you have to win by two to decide the winner. So just 10 points stand between who will pick up the first team win. to serve Stani Harris. Group win. Oh, that fell down. That usually happens, Cam, with the humidity in the night. The ball doesn't bounce up, it just goes down. Slides down the glass. Exactly. And there's nothing you can do with that. Wow. Oh, and another dive from Tolito. This one, no good. One all. Score one apiece. As this is a 10 point tie break. That's oh, a violation called on LA. The umpire said the player from LA beat Tolito Aguirre touched the net with his right foot. Tolito just cannot believe it. Let's see if we can have a look at that one. Tolito was close to the net. Can't see his feet. But it doesn't look like it. <laughs> Almost asked oh, yes, he did. The he umpire did. for a prayer. Yeah! How about that? Coming back with an outrageous cool. play for LA. Two apiece. Beauty. Three, two, to the fans. Javi Leal. Such a good player, Javi Leal. That was out. It was, yes. Three all. Three games apiece. We're going to switch sides. Everything's super tight. The team. Gonzo, what do you think this is going to come down to in the tie break? Who do you think is going to make some of the biggest plays? I mean, in my opinion, I see the beat a little bit better right now. Trying also to take advantage of the momentum they're carrying from the second set. So again, if we have to put it into percentages, I would go with a 60-40 for the beat. I'll be curious what to do see. You think? I'll be curious to see what Liho can put together. I think. A lot of this rides on his shoulders, his ability to become effective from an offensive standpoint. He was a big difference maker. In set one. And there, uh, <laughs> right on cue and on strike, there's Leo. That was for you, Cam. You were calling him, calling <laughs> him, and Leo picked up the phone. Flattening that is Lima. Nice block, and again, it's Liho. Back to back off five of three. his racket. Florida. Make it 5 3. That's three straight for the Goats. Oh. Out of bounds. Second serve. Less pace on the serve there. Another good block. The lights almost falling down off of that. We're going to break the court, Javi. Make it three. And now, yes, um, it looks like the goats are back to the first set rhythm. Thanks to the fantastic play of both Pablos. Four straight now for the Goats. 
And Cam, it's only the first day of competition, but we see a lot of people coming to this club to enjoy paddle. I cannot imagine what it's going to be like in the weekend. No kidding. Ultra Club playing host to this first and second event. Oh, amazing slice. And that might be one of the first misses we've really seen from Lima. 6-4, Florida. If Tolito celebrating the point. Stopping the four-point run of Florida. as Liho. That's been one of his best shots, but it's been covered, and it's Liao. What a cover from Tolito. He finally, off the Bajada, covered the middle. What a point there. And as soon as Tolito saw that the lob shot was short, he went, dale, dale, go, go, go for it. And Javi Leal went for it to win the point. 6-5. I'm impressed with the court adjustment there from Tolito. Oof! Another tattoo. <laughs> Six hole change. A little present yeah. from the PPL. <laughs> we're gonna switch sides again. Some music, some drinks. Back to the action again. We don't have drinks. <laughs> some water maybe? <laughs> but the VIP area That's does That's coming have later. A, <laughs> Six all, it's a three-point run for LA. It's been a series of runs. Do you say that's pretty traditional in paddle? Yes, whenever you start feeling finding something, it's kind of usual to win several points in a row. It's really hard to make a prediction in this one, Cam. Could go to anyone. Six all. Race to four. And make it a race to three for LA. LA beats. Seven six. Los Angeles. Por cuatro. Por Leal. A four point run for Los Angeles. Cutting down at the feet of LA. Oh, and it's been rare that he's had a missed hey, contact. Los Angeles. On the bandeja. It was not the moment to do it. Not the moment to make a mistake. It's 8 6 for the beat, only two points away of the victory. Every time he goes to block, he's really shifting that court Eight, position seven, further to the middle and no realizing that backhand block. So now Cam is going to be the turn for the beat to serve. And they're going to have a couple of them to close the deal. They get the first one. It's 9-7. They have two match yeah, points. 9-7 for Los Angeles. Nine seven is our score for LA. First match point. Excuse me, the goats now. Nine seven. They escape. Nine eight. Los Angeles. They gotta save. fight back one more. They save the first match point. There's another one for the beat. Now receiving. They go towards Lima. Lima has to work off the glass. Beat playing patient. And that is into the top of the net. The LA beat. 
after dropping the first set, walk away with the second 6-4 and the tie break set, 10-8. Things were not going well in the first set. Then Li Ho was playing amazing, eight. Pablo Lima too, but then something changed in the second set. Pure chemistry between these two guys to carry on into the super tiebreak and to win, to get the first point. The LA beat, good start for this team. Good start for the beat. It was a tale of two different teams for Los Angeles. A wonderful performance after dropping set one. Tolito's all smiles, as is Javi Leal. That was brilliant. Okay. Javi Leal. Oh. Amazing, amazing. Great amazing. mental oh. comeback. He was not playing his best match, but the mental strength to stay focused, to stay in the game, to be able to bring his best game again back to the main court. They uh, helped Tolito to win. <laughs> Again, this man for all. is going to give us a lot of highlights. <laughs> and if Javi Leal is on point, it's going to be an unstoppable duel, or at least a hard team to beat in this pro panel league camp. <laughs> Get a chance to catch up with Javi Leal as well as Tolito as they head off to our Javi. Another Javi, the third one in the day. We have Javi Leal, Javi Barahona now. Our Javi Carrasco with the winners with Tolito Aguirre and Javi Leal from the LAP. Let's go with the winnings of the match. Congratulations, Los Angeles beat, Tolito Aguirre, Javi Leal. What an amazing match, incredible. So, so time, highlights. What an incredible game. The first question, Tolito, for you in Spanish. It has been incredible. How have you done it? A lot of magic with Javi Leal. It's been a combination perfect. Well, thanks to all the people who came. For me, it's a pleasure to play with Javi. I have to admit that at the beginning I was a little nervous por jugar con esta bestia y por jugar en contra de un ídolo de toda la vida como Pablo, como Pablo Lima. Eh, la verdad es que eh, no tengo explicación por, haber, por haberle ganado. Sé que, que ya ni siquiera creo que entrena, pero eh, es algo increíble ganarle a, a, un, a un mito del padre. It's a pleasure to play with Javi Leal. Well. First of all, uh, Tolito Aguirre said that your idol is Pablo Lima is a legend of this sport. It's incredible to win him. And Javi Leal, here in Spanish too. Uh, ¿Cómo ha sido, Javi? ¿Qué sensaciones tienes jugando aquí en Miami? La verdad que, bueno, buenas, tarde, eh, buenas noches a todos. Ha sido un partido muy complicado. Primero por, por, bueno, gran culpa la tienen ellos, que han jugado a un nivel altísimo. Y después yo, por ejemplo, he estado un poco nervioso. De, del ambiente que hay y demás, pero bueno, hemos sabido sacarlo. Leo me ha ayudado muchísimo y nada, a seguir. He was a little bit nervous, but it's a pleasure to see here. So, thank you so much, Los Angeles B, Javi Leal, Antolito Aguirre. We will see you in the next match.